Preseason is done. Okay, I, I want to show you something, right? This is a bit hilarious. Let's go to Star Search, right? Let me bring the music down. Okay. All right, guys. Hey, you, you guys know who Goose Hitting is, right? I'm, like, I'm treating you like stupid people. <laughs> You're not right. Okay. Goose Hitting. Okay, what are the odds that you can sign him? Like, you shouldn't be able to, right? <laughs> Approach the sign. Goose Hitting is going to come to me. Yeah, well, let's, let's, you know, we can tell him to be a head of youth development. We can tell him to be... The problem with FM22 right now is it is very easy to get loan signings for clubs. So, and some high-profile managers or coaches, it, they don't even have to be high-profile. The guy can be a head of youth development or manager at Valladolid, right? Manager at Valladolid, and I can ask him to come over to be a coach at Borussia Mönchengladbach. Right, so there are one or two things that are wrong at the moment. I wasn't the, I wasn't the one who found who found this it was the FM guru. So he was telling me about it. So I said, "Hey, I found this man." Tactics wise, I think we should be fine. Uh, so we we done okay, right? So we've done our thing. We've done our training. Oh, calendar. Let's just make sure that yeah, okay. Balance early season. Let's do some balance. Some more balance early season. We need it. We need this to run to at least October. One tactic as well. I mean, I might change tactics. You know what I'm like, right? I get bored very quickly. That's why I wrote the book to remind myself. But then apparently, it, I, you know, I give it to other people like you guys. <laughs> and I don't read my own stuff. What's last Tindall? Now, again, he's okay. He's not phenomenal. So, and I look at my team. Well, I, who the heck is going to score my goals for me? Then I looked at the guys. I got Jonas Hoffman. We know all, we know all about him. Finishing composure 12-12. Uh, Hannes Wolf, uh, I, yeah, I've used him on uh, draft mode as well. He's okay as a shadow striker. Then we've got Florian Neuhaus. Yeah, he's another one that can actually play in a shadow striker position. So we've got so many guys who can play as shadow strikers. Except I haven't registered him. The players aren't fantastic. Alassane Plier, I like him. He's he's reasonable. All right. He's off in injury, so I, I don't want to endanger. Brie Lambolo is just coming back from injury. Right. Otherwise, he might be a partner for Stindle. All right, so we got this game coming out. This is going to be a man. This is going to be a man. Okay. Because one of the worst ways to start is Bayern Munich first game. I mean, we we were just monkeying about during the YouTube live stream, but trying all kinds of nonsense tactics. I didn't even prepare properly for this. So we have to wing this. Okay, first up, I'm not going to... I'm gonna just going to go on attacking. We want to... We're playing like this. Um, okay, this should be fine. Okay, this... It's much higher line against standard defense. I won't send the boys up. This, I'm going to drop. <laughs> okay. All right. What about this? Roam from position on this guy. Roam from position on that guy. Okay. That's a change in FM22 based on somebody, some some guy called someone. I won't name, mention names, but, you know, it's not you. It's somebody here, but it's not you. Okay. Kind of sent in a bug report and told SI that we have to remove the gap further forward because this guy is becomes Mr. Super ball winning midfielder. So that's gone. There's no more there. It's not there anymore. But for all those guys using the Segundo Volante, good news for you. Because the role is not used very often, we can still use the Segundo Volante and tell him to get further forward and become the Super Box Box midfielder. So that's still available. Yeah, so we, we're going to get a wing back, wing back inside forward. This guy is going to be an attack duty. Passing forward with an AM. AM Muller is going to be an attack as well. Um, AP ah, the AP is a viable role now in four two three uh, in a four two three one already. It's very nice, got plenty of nice movement. Let's see what happens here. It's the only thing they changed in trading is it gave us the button back. The button did they took out. We had the button since the days of Championship freaking manager. Okay, so what they did was somebody in SI Tower must be so <laughs> and scream. Somebody in SI Tower was very high. Was going, what the hell is wrong with this bloody train the other foot? Why do I have to create a specific trade session for it? Okay, put it back in. That must have been what happened, man. There could not be any other explanation. Okay, because it's back in, but the success rate is the same as last year, right? So it's a 20% success rate. So don't expect that. You know, don't expect someone to miraculously, you know, for it to happen. Second, is still an attribute from 1 to 20. And it takes a while. So, yeah. All those things. Okay, so at pieces, corners. What are we doing for corners? Nothing too fantastic. The same. I'm, I'm sharing the, all this with you because it's basically the same as... I'm just keeping it simple because apparently corners are a bit, still a bit OP. 
But you know, I don't know if you guys know me by now, but I'm so lazy when it comes to this. I, I this is a one part of this game I don't care about because even guys who work at SI don't like the set piece creator. They want to change it to. It's just that it's such a big gargantuan task to do that they have to do everything else first because it it's probably be depressing, you know, going into the set piece creator. Oh my god, I have to do all the coding for this again. That's like freaking two million lines of code. Yeah, right. It's a lot of code, man. All right, so we, I want to be impressed. Do we do, we do that? Very first game of the season. <laughs> this thing about team talks, right? I want to be impressed, boys. You're playing Bayern Munich. Go out there. Do the deed. What kind of a manager does that? Head over to the assistant manager. I don't want to take responsibility for this. So here we are, Bundesliga. First game of the season. Borussia Mönchengladbach are home to Bayern Munich. Do you think training makes a difference when some of the team is wasting chances? No, 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 no. That is tactics, man. Raw baby. Training does not improve your conversion rates. Attribute improving attributes do. So training only. The most important thing about training is before a big game, have your match preparation activities, right? So you have things like uh, attacking set pieces, defending corners, have those in, right? Because they give you a short bonus, and that's what you really, really want, right? So we're gonna watch this on extended highlights because uh, anything anything shorter than that will probably be. Not good. <laughs> Alright, we gotta change things around straight away. I'm, I'm quick, man. We're not taking chances here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I know what to do. Wait, wait, I know what to do. I know what to do. I know what to do. Wait, we don't change that first. Maybe we have something else we can do. Bring back on support. Bring back on support. Okay. Let's not go on a... Yeah, let's just keep this on attacking first. I wish there were a man like you in French. In French? That's Guru! Guru is the same. Drakey, I mean, if you, do you catch FM Guru streams? Yeah, go and check his streams out. Yeah. He knows his shit too. We played, no? We actually played Fantasy Draft together. I was 2 nil up on him and then he came back and leveled the score 2, two all because he wanted to see whether Fantasy Draft was okay. Then we discovered we're not doing it again. I'm not playing with another guy in France ever again because the lag was terrible for me, him and me. <laughs> for me, it was okay, but for him, it was like, dude, I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. Right? So our games were not like this, 18. It was like, it will pause like this, and then it will go. Then it will pause like this, then it will go. It, will pause. it was like watching a game in real time, except it was on key highlights. Okay, Ben Sabani, to Zakaria, to Hoffman and Stone! <laughs> Stindle with the shot. Yeah, FM Guru. He's on Twitch. You just have to do twitch.tv FM Guru. I, I can check with him. Well, let me go and send him a message. <laughs> He's a very nice guy. You should check him out. He's a uh, SI. And now he's working for SI. Okay. Oh, the ball goes up. The ball goes up. Yeah. So, if, so you should be able to help you out. All in French. Okay, we got Lena on the ball. Our goal is not to lose. So we might have to break a few legs. Alvedi puts it out to Kramer. Zakaria. Oh, what a ball to Stindle. Stindle is true. Oh, no. He makes a save. Oh my goodness, that's the first true ball. Here yeah, wait, somebody just complained. We don't have any central true balls on Football Manager 22. I just did one. 31, min 31 minutes into the game. Kweshi Pain, thanks for the follow, man. Okay, we got Stindel with the free kick. Don't know. Ooh, what a save from Noya. Afonso Pair, welcome to the channel. Okay, we've got Hoffman now with the corner. Oh, oh, I didn't change this. Kramer. He takes it into the box. Somebody clears the danger. It's going to be whoever that player was. The highlights were just too fast. Okay, we're going to slow things down. Okay. Now, you know, this this distant this bar here sets the speed at which you can take a breath in this game. All right, what do we say to them? We'll give it to the assistant manager. Okay, done. Life is simple. Why do you want to do so much work on your own? Hoffman. I don't even do press conferences, man. Okay, Bayer with the ball. Eases it to Ben Sabani. Wolf says, I'm going to give it, but Kimmich shows his quality by intercepting the ball. What do you think about two white centre-backs on attack? and a Oh, brilliant. Who's that? Benjamin. Oh, love it. You have the player swipe, please do it. It's absolutely scintillating. It's the best combination right now in the game for the white centre-back. If you have the players for it, right, you can play a uh, Libero on support because the Libero can do killer balls. Right? And then you got the white centre-backs. So what you want to do is a 
You want to do a tactic which doesn't have too high a tempo as well. Uh, that will be very nice. You should look at Ginter. Right, so you have a very good Libero. That's why I'm playing as a ball playing defender. I'm a bit weary of playing as a Libero at the moment. I don't know. I mean, this is a tough game. So I, I don't want to take too many chances. That's a nice ball to Ben Sabani, man. He plays a simple pass to Wolf. And then Wolf into Zakaria. He's gone in. He misses. Oh, no. <laughs> Please, God, help me now. How many chances do we are we going to miss? Do you think training makes a difference? For example, if my team is raising chances, I set a bunch of chance conversion. Nope, it won't help, man. Raw baby. Raw baby. As far as training is concerned, it's there to improve your attributes. The only thing training can do for a real game... Oh, no. Oh, no. Mr. Laner is early in the season, son. What has happened to you? Potential ball injury. My guys, balls are injured, man. Okay, Kony, you come in here. I got, I got, I'm not putting anyone else. Actually, he can. Patrick Herman, he can do the job. But I want to put a, um, uh, I want to put somebody because this ball winner might have to come off. Oh man! Ideally, I want somebody who can play in that position, right? So he, he, I mean, he can play as a DM. This, this is a bit of a push, but his attributes are fine. So what do you want? Oh man! Okay, what do you want to do? Is uh, training only help? Why the ball is such a funky color? Can't it be blue? Look at her ball color. This is a licensed league, right? So this, this is a licensed ball. <laughs> That's the thing about SI right now. This is a licensed league. It's got a licensed ball. I got no choice. I've got no choice in the matter. SI has got no choice in the matter. They got all the assets from the Bundesliga, including the bloody ball. Oh, no. <laughs> we got to get a ball mod, man. Okay, Ben Sabani is on six. Okay, this is this is where things get a bit hairy scary, guys. <laughs> they get a bit hairy scary at this point. <laughs> Gonna drop the tempo. Uh we 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 look for subs we look for guys on the bench. <laughs> um this is where I need to think of I need to replace him. Okay. Let's see whether we got any options on the bench. Substitute of we, we, Florian Neuhaus can't tackle. Uh, let's see. Okay, we, okay, we have one guy. Luca Nash. What's he like? Are you a defend, decent def fullback? Okay, you are okay. Your composure concept. 18-year-old is going to get a debut. No, we will just we just keep going. Okay, ben Sabani is doing well. So, Stindl is injured. Okay, everybody is now, everybody's now got ball cramp. Okay, <laughs> Sorry for the language, but it sounds that way. Whenever somebody gets a groin injury, it's like, for me, it's a ball cramp. Okay, we got a ball. Come on. There's a eight, five minutes left. Okay, you know, normally I tell people, this is not the time for you to have a shout, right? Because the shout doesn't really have much of an effect with five minutes left. Apparently, apparently, <laughs> apparently, <laughs> apparently, <laughs> boss, the damn thing in the shot. My, what's wrong with this game? The, the state of the buttons need to be improved. Mosiala. Okay, through ball. I can't see the ball as I... <laughs> I can't see the ball as I... <laughs> what a... Acrobatic clearance of Kramer. Stealing my revenge against Stick Piano. Oh, you need a revenge. I got my revenge on Stick Piano already. I got knocked out of the draft competitions, right? Okay. And uh, the, I won the game. There was only one game that mattered to me during those draft competitions against Stick Piano. So I beat Stick Piano and I was like... I was like, yeah, I beat Stick. Oh no, Musiala is Gnabry. It's a phenomenal. Oh man. Yeah, FFM32. Oh man, we played so well. We should have won. We had a very good chance of winning the game on numerous occasions, right? Put through three times for one on one chances with the keeper. Instead, we don't win the game, we lose two players. Uh, we lost two players to injury. Mr. Good is Bayern mate. Put up a fight. I am putting up a fight. Wait, I put up a I put up a fight. I lost one boy had a ball. One boy had a groin injury, and the other one has had to come off. But yeah, we had a big fight. My view on the data hub, well, it's a very good addition to the game. I am totally for the data hub. The data hub is a fantastic addition. Seriously? He was put through. <laughs> <laughs> he
He was put through. And what does he do? <laughs> he needs to be shot. He was put through. And it's like you just have to slap the ball into the back of the net. He decides. What does he decide to do? I'm taking it to the line. Uh, yeah. We don't deserve to lose this game, man. We do not deserve to lose this game. First game of the season against Bayern Munich. So we'll have to get back to Bayern. Hey, Randuga, how are you, man? Welcome to the channel. Thanks for joining the chat for the first time ever. It's a joke, right? More like lamb. Is that a custom skin? No, this is not. This Bundesliga has its own custom skin. So when you go to the German Bundesliga, right, and you play for the first time, you get these Bundesliga assets that come with the game because it's licensed. And, you know, as you know, SI wants everybody, SI must have some very good relationship with the Germans. They pay for the assets anyway. So you put in the game. Makes sense. But I wish they had a way to do it in uh, for all the other leagues as well. Of course, it's going to be expensive. Okay, guys, we've got detail level coming in, right? I know that all this is taking some time, uh, but I am very certain come November the 9th, it'll be a lot faster. You notice there's a long lag. I can actually go back coffee, come back, and this thing will still be here. <laughs> all right. So, yeah, this this will be fixed, right? I, already, I know about this, yeah. We put up a fight. Yeah, we did. Do you think there's a lot of crosses in the match engine? There's always going to be lots of crosses, man, Kemi. I think there's a way too many. There's a fair bit. But the, you have to remember crosses in the match engine are not calculated the same way crosses are calculated in all the stats. Right. Even a cutback is counted as a cross. So to you, it might look like a pass, but the machine counts it like a cross. So that's the reason why crosses are such a high number in the match engine. So we think of these crosses as crosses like as in like a regular cross, right? But in the match engine, a simple thing like a, the guy goes up to he comes up to here and he does a cut back, right? To us, it's a pass, right? But to the match engine, it's con considered a cross. So don't that's SI's explanation to me and my explanation to you guys. Hello, hi, eighty nine people watching me today. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. <laughs> I will be. I don't come here very often. Like I'm on YouTube most of the time. But I decided, hey, I should come back to Twitch. You know weekends since my kids have taken over the damn TV and all the entertainment devices in the house on weekends so I told my kids say you can have all of this I'll have Twitch Borussia Mönchengladbach well we had the first defeat of the season alright we're gonna stick to this I'm gonna stick to one tank thing I mean I have another tank thing which is this okay let's switch that easily and of course we have oh, I'll, just, I'll show you guys my tactic okay we've got loads of tactics here this tactic guys this is insane. Let's play this for a while. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to play it. I don't care. You spied a 22 version of Liquid. Yeah, there's a 22 version. A lot of tactics from bloody 2003, guys. This was a tactic I made in 2003. Right. So the concept of the tactic was very simple, right? So we have this white center backs. Back in 2003, right? We, we couldn't send the players out, if you remember. Right? So we had to put arrows on them, right? So to get them into the wider positions. So you used to put an arrow here and an arrow there, right? So we got this and I got Neuhaus playing here. I think this can work. This is going to be a winger on the left. We got advanced forward. We got DLF on support. We got inverted winger here. Focus play. Okay, we'll try this. See, I mean, it's only... You know, what, what's worse that can happen, right? I'll have to recover and get my way back in again. Really struggling? Oh, man. You play a 4 2 3 one again, pressing will be fine. Yeah. Yeah, it's yeah, Chico. It is Scramjet. But I don't know if it's going to work. So let's see if it works. I tested it on a few games, but it's not enough, right? You have to play it for like an entire season and two, you know. And then you could then eventually find the right place because Scramjet's biggest weakness was he needed like a five-game bidding period. Back, even back then, he needed like five or six games. And then you had to find the... You still had to find like in at least one or two of the right players, especially the guy up here, the feeder. We, got, I, we have one feeder here. I already got a corner highlight, man. That's fast. Hoffman with a corner. Crosses seem ridiculous. Yeah, they got a lot of crosses. But I think a lot of these crosses, you have to be very careful as well. Cutbacks count like crosses. Like, if the guy comes all the way here, there's a cutback. It counts as a cross. That's what SI told me. 
Alvedi. The ball back to Ginter. That's nice. Plays it out to Kramer. That's a halfback. Ooh, what a ball. Ooh, yes. Yeah. Stindel takes it. Turum takes it. Oh, yeah, baby. Go out to the flag. He plays the way I want him to play. <laughs> yes, babies. It's going to work with the right players. The right players. It's going to tear the teams apart. Come on, baby. This, this is our own tactic, man. It's going to work, man. All I needed was the white centre-backs to go out. <laughs> Oh man, do you see this by Levick Houston? <laughs> I love this tactic. Okay. But then, you know, I need the right players still. Okay. You don't don't have the right players for it. I think I'm gonna get I'm gonna get owned. So that's the white center back. He's supposed to do underlapping, right? So he's gonna have this time to do underlapping runs. That's it. And Hoffman comes in. Square, square. We are two. We are there. We are there. <laughs> we are there, guys. What a goal. <laughs> this is like a tap-in. <laughs> Definitely works, man, Azaris. Okay, here we go. Adraki comes in. I, I don't I don't want to play this because if I play this right, I have to if it's if it scores too many goals, I get into trouble. Then I have to send it in. Then they have to plug the gap. <laughs> already have sent, already sent in one tactic. Please don't make me send in another tactic. I don't want to send in another tactic. I just want to keep this tactic. <laughs> I don't want to send. So we stretch the field of play with these guys. The, the guy that is coming off the pitch right now, apparently. <laughs> He's injured. <laughs> these guys don't want to work for me anymore. Huh? Either foot is okay. Alright, we get an either foot. And two injuries already. 25 minutes in. 6-3 win at Watford for Manchester. That's, that sounds like a damn good win. That's a damn good win, man. Okay, go, 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 go. Nice. Nice. Look at the way they mark the player. Alvedi looks up. See Stindle. Stindle needs... To, okay. That means I have to go and get a player that's got a good jumping reach for this position. That's original. This guy is supposed to be an all-purpose action uh, comp uh, advance forward, right? This, this role is damn important. If he if you get a short ass for this role, it's not gonna work. Shit, it's true. Uh, but he's gonna be yeah, he's gonna have to try and chip the keeper. Are there more changes from 21 to 22, then 20 to 21? Yeah, there's a lot more changes because the inverter wing back is now a role that is going to stay uh parked in his pocket. So remember in uh FM21, when you play the inverter wing back and you play an overlap, right? He will do the overlap. Now he doesn't do that anymore, he stays in the DM pocket. Which means that your inverted wing back tactics are not interesting because uh, you can actually have attack duties. Where previously people just play support duties for the central midfielders. Now you can actually have a few attack duties. Oh man, this got an equalizer. Poor defending, man. How's the 4 3 3? If create, I mean, by the 4 3 3 is always going to create few chances for you in the game. Um, you have to like push more players into attack for the 4 3 3 to be uh, viable. So that's something that you have to bear in mind when you make the 4 3 3. You have to create, you have to go round a block because you only got one player. You got a lot of players wide, so you have to go round blocks, which is the biggest challenge of a 4 3 3. So you have to make, you know, do things like overloads and stuff like that. And you have to do that. You have to go round the block, right? So you have to use those, uh, you have to use the full width of the pitch. Most people, their 4 3 3s have uh, low XGs, right? But, or they could have high XGs, but a lot of low percentage shots. Okay, Kramer, come on. Yeah, Alvedi to Bayer. Goes down the flanks. Got plenty of options. Now we do the run around. Come on, guys. Okay, good. Wolf. Okay, does it. Nice. Boom! It's two. Is this the same tactic you showed yesterday in YouTube? Skufakos is... Uh, wait. Um, the one on the short, which showed the underlapping uh, wing back, right? This is the one. I didn't want to... Uh, please, yeah. It's a phenom fantof fantastical. This looks too easy. Two one up. Yeah, don't say it, uh, Zaris. You're gonna jinx me, you know, I'll tell you. Comes in the first thing he says, my Singaporean friend tells me it's too easy. I like this. Okay, keep it up. Go go go. Shit takes the ball. Is oh don't get a penalty. Oh no! 
Shoes, what a block. Oh no, it's a header. What a save from Somla. Okay, come on. Okay, we're gonna we're not gonna see anything, right? So we're just gonna just chill. Shake out to the frame. But and I'm not playing maximum pressing intensity FYI. I'm just playing three quarter. Oh no, 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 no. Good, 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 good. Okay. There's no maximum pressing intensity in any of my tactics. I'm I, I've never had the need to do that. So even in FM21, I never played maximum pressing intensity. I've never used game pressing for that matter. Okay, this is good defending. They're keeping it tight. That's nice. Uh, but you know something, this kind of highlights a, is a recipe for disaster, right? Like the AI has the ball and then we are defending and they're going to crack one from outside the box. That's safe. Maximum pressing good headless chickens most of the time. Yeah, it's just boring football. Not too bad, not too bad. Okay, we'll leave it to the S-Man. Second. Okay, now we're going to encourage the boys. Come on. Primpong. Good boy, good boy. Follow. Don't let him... Uh, keep up, keep up, keep up. Good work. Yeah. When United don't play well, it's normally because they don't have, have that holding presence Trying to win the ball back. Oh, nice. That's how you win the ball back. Rob. Okay, square. 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 Oh, he tried to. He tried to. He heard me. He heard me. Nice. Well, Elvedi with the ball. Slides it. Whoa, nice. Neuhaus shoots. It's number three. Guys, we are doing it finally. Finally. We are happy as can be. What a goal from Noyos. So we we lost the first game to Bayern Munich and we've come back 3-1 against this team. You think Scram Jet 2022. But I don't even know if it's gonna work for long. We just created this tactic, we'll see how it does. Stindle. Yeah, Stindle. These are this these players are not they're not playing badly. Stindle, okay, nice. Check it back. Oh, what a ball! Woof! Oh, the defender got in a last-ditch save. Elario. Okay, 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 good. Follow track, 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 track. Nice work from LVD. He's very unhappy. He, I tried to get him to sign a contract. He said, no. Take the contract and shove it up your ass. That's basically what he said to me. Okay, so we've got Lucas Nets. We're going to put him here. Okay. Right. Okay, we've got Slammer. Taking short kicks. I want to. I might want to roll it out. Wolf, nice work. Oh, yeah, you're right, man. Who is the one who said Wolf? Bloody guy plays for Bayern Munich. <laughs> you, one of you, right? <laughs> Guys, hey, yeah, I'm gonna go home, man. I, I want to turn off the stream. I'm gonna turn off the stream, man. Andy, I don't wanna play anymore, man. You guys are, you guys are jinxing me. Like, what the hell? Play for Bayern Munich. The moment you say that, he gives the ball away. And we almost get a score. Never trust a guy called Wolf. If and you two join them. Yeah. My goodness, you guys. I thought you were on my side. <laughs> and you do kind of feel it. Yeah. Some of these roles, you, you'll notice the drop. Especially with tight mark. You give them PIs as well to tight mark. And press. Always. You know, that was DRB. Oh my goodness. See, we knew this was going to happen. Amiri comes in from the back post. What a ball. My defenders are getting tired. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to... We're gonna have to... Regroup. Okay. Then what else are we gonna do? I'm gonna drop the overlap and the underlap. And I'm gonna jack this all up. I'm gonna do this. And do this. Okay. All right, man. After a one-nil defeat against Bayern Munich, we bounce back with a three-two win over Bayer Leverkusen. To send the assistant to deal with these people. Okay. All right. That's not too bad. Jonas Hoffman injured. Another one bites the dust. A monshin scramjet project is on. Now. Well. So once they. Once they're good enough, I want to sign them. 
once I mean my scouts fine enough to use that is. So I'm still tracking. We gotta scout the Simons out. So we got all these places that we're going to. You, you know, you guys know right, South America has been changed. There's no more west anymore, and east is north and south, uh, north and south, yeah. Yeah. So looking at our tactic, didn't do too badly. Didn't do too badly. We've got advanced analytics already because we went and uh, hired a few staff, right? Uh, performance analysts. Side to behold, I mean, this is not really... So there are a lot of key passes coming from our wing backs, which is very important. Okay. So this is our white center back. White center back. Okay. Let's... I will go through the data later. Let us let it populate first. Uh, this is more important to me. I actually want to see how many shots I had inside the box to know whether the tactic is any good. Because if a tactic gives you a very high XG, right? But you have a lot of shots with the head. A lot of shots coming from direct side pieces. Right, then it's kind of a crap tactic. So you want a lot of your, a lot of our chances were coming from inside the box. That's not too bad. Okay. So we got two goals, eight attempts, eight with the feet, all inside the box. Okay. So we created a lot of clear cut chances in our first game with that tactic. There's plenty of hope. So it's not the tactic's fault that we are not we didn't score more goals. It's the player's fault. So we're going to change this to um, set pieces attacking corners. I, If you can't tell, I'm still a bit tired of Futa Wave because I didn't sleep, man, when the game launched. <laughs> Futa Wave, thanks for the follow, man. You always take off first, but it just seems right. Yeah, it does seem right, right? I don't like the idea of signing immediately after I join the club. That's been me for a long time. Okay, Borussia Mönchengladbach, Union Berlin. How are they doing? Let's see. Let's see the situation, right? Union Berlin. Okay. Got Dreta Hub, there's no news. <laughs> got no next opponent overview nothing zero jack shit apparently they don't work like what the hell <laughs> okay <laughs> so we like yeah this is gonna be challenging man chico the miko let's go man bk eaten and chico in the house jupa mr jupa how are you okay team selection let's go team selection they're playing a back five well we'll see how we do okay we got nets okay the our left back is injured, right? Last Dindle, you piece of shit. You can't even score a goal. 12, 14. At least his dribbling is better. So I'm going to get Bayer to play instead. Okay. All right. We got Bayer. We got Manu Kone. What's his attributes like? Passing, vision, decisions. He's not going to He's not gonna unlock any defense tomorrow. Okay. What about Neuhaus? Passing, vision, decisions. Like, okay, he can lock. He can unlock defenses. So we'll put him instead. Okay. Because of the fact that I can play white center backs, you know how happy that makes me. Because it means because in FM twenty one there was this all these back three systems were just not viable. I won't say they weren't viable in the sense that you can't play with them, but because you can't do so much with them, you know, like we want our center backs to actually push up the pitch, create a pendulum effect so we can bring more players into attack. We just couldn't do it in FM twenty one because it just stayed rooted to the the halfway line. But now it's a different story. So we got all kinds of options. I can I can actually bring back old tactics from I made in like so many years ago, which are all based on that principle. You know, you want the centre backs to get up the pitch. But now we can. So this just means all these tactics are bang back in again <laughs> on cue. Twenty five seconds into the game, Borussia Mönchengladbach have taken the lead. <laughs> Man, this is beautiful. This is what I want to see. Because the moment those white center backs come up, look at that. They push everybody up the pitch so you can afford to be a bit more creative with your tactics. And I love, that's what I love about FM21. That's my Ben Sabani. He wouldn't have moved up had not he had Ben Sabani not been here. But in FM21, this guy stays here, this guy stays around here if that kind of thing happens, right? So you have to put him on attack just to get to the box, which was a very annoying. Uh, do I, pray? I encourage the team even more. See what happens to them, right? Body language all changes. Like, what the hell? Uninterested in the feedback. What kind of manager is this? Encouraging us. Come on, boys. You're doing well, boys. Let's get another goal. If SI is trying to replay, you know, as you're the manager, you would only call for a meeting if you want. Yeah, exactly. I hate meetings. I, th I think meetings are... In real life, meetings are a waste of time unless you have something important to say. Right? Will your defense get too exposed to two wide centre-backs? No. It might if you're both on attack, but if you have a DLP, if you have a DP, a DM, right? So the best D 
DM role actually is a halfback. In my, in my honest opinion, it's a halfback. Because a halfback is the most aggressive. You don't want somebody who's like an anchor man. An anchor man's priority is to stay very close to the defenders. Then there's a they're too close. So you want a role that's slightly further forward, maybe like a halfback or a defensive midfielder. These are the two best. But yes, there is a risk of getting exposed. So you've got to be very careful of these wide attacking systems, like a 4 4 2 4 2 3 1. Because once they get into this kind of position, it can be a it can be a problem. It might go. Yeah, it's changed formations. This is the only thing I don't like about this current match engine. It's been the same since God knows when. Uh, they don't really go like um, they don't change their plan with 15 minutes to go. They change their plan with like five minutes to go. Manu Kone takes it down, crosses the ball. Oh, oh, oh! They spill the ball. Get there. Yeah, Ginter does well. Uh oh, this is dangerous. Ginter's out of position. He is out of position. Just stay tight. Good work. Okay. This is like the should have done this earlier. Okay, down he goes. Pooch, pooch, arch. Weird. We're not managing this game very well. Okay, good defensive header. No, it's not. Their, their header missed. Okay. When when Drongolin, no, it's, it's not bad. It's not a bad player. From I um I know when. The left uh, sided central defender who actually is also not a bad white centre back. I'm a teacher, I've been meeting twice a week. One of the meetings last one hour and the other one last two hours. <laughs> that one. But hey, do you have any time to teach? McGinn and Manchester United? Nah, nah. They want, United is a ball winner, not McGinn. They already got too many McGinns in that team. They got Paul Pogba there. They got playmakers, right? They don't need McGinn. Unless I'm mistaken. We're gonna have to do something. Okay. Sure, so three minutes left, they actually pull one back. But we're feeling a bit bruised. Bruised and tattered. I don't have really a lot of players to substitute in this team. I have to look at the bench now. What I could have also done was like drop the winger to like a white midfielder. Or defensive winger. But I don't have those players at the moment, right? My, that's my problem right now. If I go defensive winger, he closes down a lot more. Then he also, he's also going to get very tired. So this is just disappointing. But it's okay. We'll be fine. We have to manage this phase because we're losing play. We got injuries. Uh, let's see what we have in the team. Mm, overview. Michael went so no, not good enough. I think what we'll have to do now is do it this way. Okay. Okay. All right. We'll come in here and see what we got. Whether we got players that can play stamina, work create. That's it, man. Maybe this guy. Who's he? This is a wing back, Joe Scally. Mm. The American. Okay. All right. Right. He can play on the right. We can use somebody on the right. Okay, so we move him, squad, move to Borussia Mönchengladbach squad. If I can't use him, I'll just move him back. I don't know yet, right? So, I'll just move him there first. He'll be, we'll move him in and out. He's probably going to get pissed. Stamina, 13, no. Who's this guy? 15, 13, 12, 10, 10. Pass, comp composure, 9. He's on loan. Mm, not many left, man. Okay, that's it. Let's look for defensive midfielders. Stamina will create 13, 13, 13, 13, 10, 13, 15. Who's this? Oh, you're on loan. 13, 13, nobody. Stamina 12, 13, 13, 13. Who's this? Mm. Not good enough. 13. Man, Andre Spolson, if you're at this club, man, I can use you. I can really use this player. Okay, defenders, do you have any other choices? Jumping reach. 14. Stamina 5. 15 stamina 8. 12, 13 stamina 9. This is the only one. Joe Scally. Okay, Joe Scally, I can use him as a white center back, maybe. Maybe he can be a white center back. Concentration 9 is too dangerous. Oh, I actually don't have anyone. I don't have anyone. Midfielders. Oh, nobody in this club, man. Just this guy is tackling is 9, 9. Composure is 5. Oh my goodness. Composure in this team is... Only this... I, could, I can only consider these players. 
The rest of the players, no. Sandy Christiansen balance. You lose the ball the moment he turns. Jumpridge, Stamina can't even play. Okay. Yeah. We got a, we got to survive with this team until January. Man. That's the goal here. Survive with this lot until January. Manchester United feel incredibly over tuned and they're absolutely blowing away the league in my so Yeah, I know. They are. So I, I, I don't know what's going on there as well. We mentioned, I think we mentioned, the thing here as well, in FM 22, right? The AP role, guys, you got to try out the AP role. It's bananas, man. It's so good right now. It's just like, even in a 4 2 three, one right now, it's a damn good role. It's insanely good. I mean, it's like one of the, one, uh, it's such a good role compared to the time to before. Hey, Depeche, how are you, man? Man, the moment I saw you, I want to see Depeche. Depeche mode. Alright. Alright, let's go to training. Let's do the training because we have not done this role. Because I don't like doing this, which is something I just done, right? This is this is a very inefficient way of playing the game. So what you do is you want to choose the roles. If you don't know what the roles are, match them to your tactic, okay? In general, you want to choose the right roles for your players because uh, role training is actually more efficient because you are going into the game and telling them these are the roles I want you to focus on. Instead of coming in here, where the DC playing position, and you go to DC, okay, they'll choose one of these five and can be random, right? So you don't know. All right, so then we got Louis Bayer. Louis Bayer, he's 21 years old. This this dude, yeah, he can definitely get faster. So let's look at his attributes now. Okay, his jump period is 14. But look at his height, 1.87. This kid can actually jump. His jump can actually go up. His hitting needs to improve, right? So this this is a... But his uh, mentals are pretty solid. Okay, so you want to look at his training and think to yourself, okay, fine. Yeah, this is the best way to train a player. Best way. Don't ever choose this option, right? But to do this, you got to think about the attributes and how they fit into your tactic. So I'm playing a white centre-back tactic. I'm sending everybody up in attack. You know, they're all gonna just do a lot of funky shit. <laughs> Excuse the language. So, maybe if I put him as a libero, what do you think is gonna happen? He's young, right? So what will happen is he's got this finite amount of attributes. Now, when he's a finite amount of attributes, they get divided in a lot of ways. So, basically, you're not hitting the attributes you really want when he's young. So what I normally recommend to people is when they're young, Identify the attributes you really, really want. And don't be so greedy as to want all of them. Okay, so here, this is too many. And when he's older, I'll put him on Libero. What I want from him now is I want a focused development. So his heading has to improve. His marking has to improve. His tackling has to improve. These are three ones. These are technical skills. His mentals are not that bad. His anticipation goes up, would be good. So I want anticipation, concentration. 12 is too low. Way too low. So we want concentration to be there. So, okay. Let's find something for concentration. Let's go for the central defender. Defender. Bang, concentration is there, heading, marking, tackling is all there. Position is there. Technique, yeah, we can improve that passing, right? So we can do an additional focus of passing and it gets in there. But we don't have acceleration, so that means we have to choose one or two. Okay, so but this is not too bad. This is very focused. We can leave them, we can leave it, we can leave him on this for like six months and then go and change the bottom one to like quickness and we get acceleration. That's one option. Okay. By October, I'll have tactical familiarity 100% the entire team. Okay, with this setup. Then I will switch into something called a complete training schedule. Okay, that's it. We've done it. Oh, shit. Kebabs. No, no, no. Let's save the game. Ah, shit. Let's save the game before it crashes. All right, here we go. Uh, we are playing them. So we've got to talk to our boys. We've got to try and uh, I'll try and do better now. Okay, now what I'm going to do is different, right? So, okay, we've got tactics. I'm going to drop the tempo. That'll take some asking, but he deserves... I mean, I think Graham Potter is a very underrated manager as well. I think he's a good coach. Yeah, in England, they seem to be renaming everything, right? They stop calling them managers now. A lot of managers are, want to be called coaches because they coach the players, right, as well. Turam is through. Turam is in. Turam chips. Turam scores. Guys, we have started on fire. Is it possible for me to set the transfer level on my own place to not for sale like some players are in other teams? Well, you can... Tr I think... Uh, I I don't know. I haven't tried selling anybody yet because I'm transfer locked. What do you think of Vieira and Palace? I think that's a very good marriage. 
I think that's a very, very good marriage because I love Patrick Vieira. I, mean, I love Patrick Vieira as a player. And I think that he actually started off quite well, right? So some of his matches, have I've seen his sides, uh, his sides play. They're very... They've got his personality, man, in a sense. I mean, I, I get this feeling he's transferred some of his DNA to the club. <laughs> players, the way they play, they flare fighters. They don't give up. So that's a good sign. I think that, that, that bodes well for the club in the long run. Okay, we're going to give him some match time. 71 minutes. I think we can make him run for a couple of minutes. Okay. This is all small risks, you know. Zaha moves too much. Wilfred Zaha. Speedy Gonzalez. Okay, good. Free Lambo just close down. That's all I need. I need extra legs. We need to protect that side. Zach, come on. Libero, track, man. Okay, good work. My house. Nice, Turam. Run, 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 Turam. Run. Go, Turam, all the way. Give bloody hell. Run and then you give the ball there. What kind of a stupid dope thing is that to do? Keep it up, Manukune. It's like we got no other players now. Okay. 85 minutes. Okay, we're gonna drop the tempo down. And dribble less. We are guiding our way. We're surviving with this thin squad. Turam gets inside. Go. Oh. Rounding the keeper is a thing that we do, man. He's <laughs> a whole idea. He's supposed to run this way, right? And then we get these blind spots opening up on the right side so they can go and score goals. That's the whole plan. That's the whole logic behind it. I'm not going to change the tactic. I'm just going to find the players for it. See, because it's, it's, lot, it's been happening. We've seen it happen a few times. There we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that was good, man. Nice, nice, nice. Final whistle. Okay. One again. We're getting done. Sounds like a plan. We need to convert to a proper money ball save the data hub. Yeah, it should be very promising, right? Look at our data hub. Is it has it fixed itself yet? Or is it still suffering from I don't know who your strikers are? Oh, babies, we got a second rough. Apparently they needed some time to find out our strikers. I wanna see whether I'm creating good chances, right? So every shot that he gets. He's, he's normally getting a 0.19 XG shot, which is not bad. No? 0.2, because clear cut chance is 0.2 and higher. So the average shot expected goal per shot, which is basically the average shot quality that I have is 0.19. It's not bad. It's quite high. What, do, what am I missing? Shots on target per 90 minutes. So he gets about less than two shots on target. Okay, so here... Normally, you will find top strikers, no? top, top strikers are in the two range, right? You're getting two shots on target. I mean, how many strikers do you know can get more than two shots, more like three or four shots on target? If they are a top striker, three shots on target. They're going to be scoring a lot of goals, right? So this last indulge is okay. He's getting the, he's getting the shots. His bloody finishing is useless. That's all. His finishing is useless. So this is the case of the striker not being good enough, right? So we, we definitely have to go out there and get another striker. Polo is not fit, so we've got to look after him. Herman is not fit, my goodness. We are running out of fit players, man. Okay, we're going to play Baines there. We all, these players, all coming here. We've got to be very, very careful about our players right now. Long time no see. Demand more FM! Bust those nets! How are you, sir? Are you streaming soon? Guys, give a, give me a shout out to Demand More FM, guys. You guys gotta go check him out. AB on support is brilliant in FM22. Yeah, there's more damn one damn good role in a 4231. It's like even in a it's they they tweak some of the movement. So the FM in FM21 uh, 22, these APs are looking good. Oh no, Vargas is true, it's cost. This is bad football, man, for more boys. Box to box midfielder, two rum, single player. Okay, turn into an advanced forward. Turn into your left on support. You are gonna. Well, actually, I don't need you to do that. Okay, so you just come here. We'll just let this guy go off the pitch. Wing back on attack. And then we'll turn this guy into a wing back on attack. So I get the okay. game. Don't get away from these guys. I don't know how much to push my players, right? You know what I mean? Like, that's my problem right now. 
But I changed one of the roles to a DLP on. Okay, we're gonna just we wanna just push this. Okay, guys. Okay, DLP on support. Sorry, we're gonna turn into a ball winning if you don't support. We're gonna turn into a box ball. This will push our team up higher. Okay, player, how to already annoy house. Come on. Mm, we're back in this boys. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna push them up higher. Are any managers catching your eyes of late? As in real managers in the real world? <laughs> Not really. I mean, there are some managers, but you know, it's still too early, right? You want to see consistency first. It's too early in the season right now. Okay, we're gonna go. This is really dangerous. Okay, we're gonna go winger on support. And then winger on support. This is damn dangerous but i'm taking a chance wingers will go down the support the will push up right so these guys are going to try and get down the flanks it's going to expose my flanks this is the one danger in a tactic like this okay they've gone two strikers so both teams are ready to push for the winner neither one is satisfied man Henri is a terrible manager yeah i think he admits it himself it all gets away it look ah okay there we go yeah oh i can't win the hitter that's why I needed that. His last Tindall is just on his last legs. Oh no, this is it. We set ourselves up for a massive fail. Yep, we did. We pushed. I went for it. I went for it. I wanted to win so badly. There is no risk without... There's no reward without risk. Come on, Elvedi. Neuhaus. Pony. Neuhaus. Bans. Boom. Yeah. <laughs> Be back in this is 2 2, but it's all a throw, man. But that's some just from a 1 0 win over Hull. Ah, you happy, are you? So it's offside. Go award it, thank god. Okay, uh, 3 0 to City. But okay, one of the reasons, uh, highlight stuff from throw is right, it's, it's basically a design decision, right? So it's a natural point for a highlight to start. Both teams strike. Okay, at least we didn't lose this game. I'm not happy with their performance. Slow, steady start. Well, we turned in a better performance after going a goal down, right? And that's all I wanted. That's all I wanted, man. That's all I wanted. Grifflet Gaming, welcome to the channel, man. No Gospels or Jahid. No, I don't think I am. Jahid is around. Yeah, he's just. Yeah, I just saw him just now. Bergsil, thanks for the follow. Man City 3, Brighton nil. I mean, this is Man City, isn't it? Alright, right, next thing you know, they're trimmed up. This, this is where I get all my information, right? So later when I do scouting, the youngsters, they'll be there. But, wanting a new contract can kiss my ass. Send Kramer in. I'm not even thinking of extending your contract. I'm thinking of like, you know what? Who can we find? I got me bothered. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. We got, we've given ourselves this challenge. We can't sign anyone, okay? So we have to make do with the players that we have. <laughs> Talk about making it harder for yourself. Okay. But I like to give make things harder for myself. Okay, so here we go. Balance of this season. That's fine. Borussia, Borussia Dortmante. This is gonna be a tough game. Alright, so are we okay? Three, 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 six days. Okay, done. Alright. Go on holiday for the next match. Ben Viking! How are you? Long time no see. Where have you been all my life? Where have you been, man? I haven't seen you for a long time. Batistuta, 1912. Hello, how are you? Hope you're well, man. Ben Viking. Back for FM22. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Yeah, FM, FM22 is going to be a very, very cool experience. From what I can see. Yeah, it's going to be very, very interesting with FM22. I mean, that, oh wait, this is the beta, so let's not be too critical about the game during this beta phase. I mean, I'm that kind of person, right, you know. I mean, beta is beta, you know. Some There's some things that don't always work out right. But if you guys love signing, I mean, these Man City fans must be so happy. They're all jumping up and down. Away? That's strange. I don't, I don't know what's going on over there. Uh, away from the pitch, for some strange reason. Okay. Um, oh, my eyesight is going.
I thought you lost the plot. What was it? School has taken most of your time. Oh, okay, good. School should always take most of your time. Not coming down here watching me stream, man. I'm becoming a teacher. That's what? You are going to inf you are going to mold the youth of the next generation. Congratulations. That's a very, very honorable profession. Very honorable. Got a lot of respect for teachers. I tried for I tried for a month and I gave up. The moment the the moment they said you got to do homework, I went like, oh shit. <laughs> Damn working. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm glad you like it too. Oh, good night. Have a have a very nice dinner, sir. How do you find the ABC rating now? What in the world are you talking about ABC rating? How is your impression of the game? I love I like the game. I think there are, the beta has got some niggling annoyances, right? There's some one or two. Um, there's a DM in this. They got AMC in this, right? It might be a problem for me. Bummer. Goes long. Come on, win the header, please. Ah, no, come on. Think about it. This tactic needs a strong left and a right. Yeah, it does a jumping reach. Right, Stin, you you wanted the new contract. I said prove it. So let's see what you have. Kuram, you have been set for crossing training. Yeah. Face it back to Kone. Nice pass to Neuhaus. What a pass from the playmaker! That is why I tell you guys, you better start thinking about the attacking playmaker, man. Oh man, I hope he's on. I hope he's not offside. I hope he's not offside because that was a hell of a pass. He was closed out right in between the legs, man. <laughs> he played nutmeg, that guy. Please don't be offside. That was one hell of a goal. I've never seen that. It's, I know it's only a bloody game, but hell, man. I love it when a plan comes together. Tindall, okay, good. Uh, take it early, you stupid idiot. That's why you're not getting a new contract for me. <laughs> Erling Haaland's going to score, yeah. The Stindle wants a new contract. He can kiss my ass. This is useless. Okay, crosses the ball and whizzes. The hitter just whizzes. Make, make a mirror version of the tactic and attack on break chances. I know, yeah, it's going to be a lot of work. I am not about to make a mirror tactic. Gigan presses. I won't say it's nerf. You just need to find the right place of Gigan pressing. That's all. You'll be fine. You get the right place of Gigan pressing. It's like every. You're still going to win more than you lose, right? And it closed him down. Go, 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 go. Good work from Zack. Yes, Hummer. Passes it to Stindle. Stindle out to Embolo. This is a counter attack. Come on. Oh, man. This is end to end action, man. Hey, come on, man. You seen our circle tactic. BB. BB isn't here. We got the circular tactic. still working, man. Okay, guys, we did well. So I want to thank everybody for coming in. You've been absolutely fantastic. And thanks uh, to, to all the guys who sub today. Uh, there's so many of you, I can't name you, but. Lovely. Thanks for all the follows. I truly appreciate it. You guys are phenomenal. We go raid McKin. Say hello to the good old man or the young boy in this case because I'm the one. So you guys stay safe. Go in there and I mean, I am like, okay, just drop a few nuts on him. Okay. I'll just put it in the chat. <laughs> go in there, just drop all these nuts on his stream, man. Just dump all the nuts you can on his stream. Okay, guys. Well, thank you guys. You guys stay safe, stay healthy. I'll see you again soon. Bye.